What inspired me, not just for football, but in everyday life, um, is my granddad. Uh, his story is inspirational to me, and uh, I think it's inspirational to most people. I was originally born in Ghana, West Africa. Yeah, I moved here when I was six years old. Um, my granddad and my mom uh, and lived in Baltimore. I've been living in Baltimore for about 11, 12 years now. But football gives me freedom. Uh, football puts me in situations like I, I didn't, I have never imagined I would be in. Right, uh, football has given me the, the platform to help me help my granddad one day. Yeah, every day I wake up, man, I'm doing something to get me to the point where he won't have to worry about anything anymore. I don't think coming here uh, and going to a school that's not stout academically is my best bet. I think. If I just go to a school that's just football based, it'd be a waste of me coming here. I'm not the brightest student out there, uh, but again, I want to push myself, you know, and I want to I wanna go to a school where after that four or five years of being at that school, I can hold that degree. I don't fear the unknown. Um, I, I'm aware of the unknown. I mean, I know that I'm not going to know a lot of stuff that's there, but I'm not. Um, I'm not scared of I'm not scared of it. That just um, encouraged me and pushes me more every day when I feel like I can't do it no more, or I don't want to do it anymore, I find it in me, you know, or the people that are, that's around me find it in me when I can't find it in myself, you know, to push me. And um, you need you need to have passion, you need to have love for the sport of football, because it's not easy. A quote that, that I forever stay with me, it's, um, the road to success is always under construction, and um, that has been so evident in my life because um, all the ups and downs that I've had to uh, go through, that, that those are all like the construction pit, you know, stop that I had to make um, to get to where I am now, you know, um, and I, the lesson that I learned from those pit stops or the things falling on me, you know, being on a construction site, you know, everything, everything doesn't go according to plan, you know, but you learn from them, you grow from them, you put it behind you and you move on. If stuff is going good, if stuff is going bad, um, they all, everything happens for a reason. Um, just be you and be true um, and know that there's always something on the other side. You know, you might not know what it is, it's going to be something. Changing the face of high school sports. S-E-N.